Ugh. Just let you know, if this was Seven Days to Die, I'd be in a lot of trouble right now. For those of you who play the game, you understand. Ah, uh, hey everybody, welcome back. Grimer here. I am playing some more Among Trees, and I am starving. Let's eat some food. I've got, I'm gonna probably want to get my next meal ready. Also, let's go ahead and grab some fish. Run upstairs, grab a mushroom, throw that in there too. Get some good, decent food going. Uh, I'm sure one of those things worked pretty well. We'll cook this bad boy up, and this will be our meal to go. Then throw that all in there. Let's cook that up. Good enough. It's not max hunger, but it's it's quite a bit. Yes, cook, cook. Thank you. Yes. Get nice and toasty, warm here on the stove. So today our goal is to make this uh, gross beak uh, wanderer outfit if we can. So I think we have the waltz bleak skins. You can see on the right side of the screen the waltz bleak skins. The beeswax is what we need, and the sewing kits or sewing threads. I think we can make. Pretty sure we have the rags too. Now I saw a beehive somewhere. I think there's one over by the bear. Makes sense, right? Uh, I'm gonna go over there and try to get that. There's two bears I found now through exploring here, so just gotta remember where those things are and to just kind of keep a healthy distance. But I'm pretty sure there is a beehive over here by the bear, and I'm gonna go smack it with a uh, with an axe. Okay, there's the bear in the fog up ahead, and here's the beehive. I knew there was one over here. Uh, let's get some stamina back here. I just ran all the way out here. All right, stamina recovered. Let's give it a good whack and then run away from here. I don't want to get eaten by bees. Circle the back around. Those bees can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. Oh, I'm stuck on something. I'm the gingerbread man. <laughs> All right, so there we got honey. I actually grabbed it this time. Look at me go. And we got the beeswax. All right, sweet. So we got that one. Now, if I, if I could get seven more of those things, could absolutely uh, get the other uh, gear that I wanted. But I don't think I'm going to. Um, I think I'll settle for what I can get. Hopefully there's enough to make that gear uh, another time. Hopefully there's like nine bees, bees high, or beehives out there somewhere. So I can collect another eight. But I'll have to remember to start grabbing those as I, as I go through. Now I do need cattails also for something. I can't remember what it was. It might be for that other outfit. And I thought I'd find some right here. But I don't see them anywhere. Unless they're over there. So I'll hop over there. I also need to get a drink of water, so this would be a good time to do that. Alright, let's go check over on this side of the river. Other side of the pond. Cattails? Anywhere? Maybe I have to find another lake. There's a fish out there. I don't have my fishing rod with me. I left that at home. Oh, here we go. Hold on. Nope, these just look like cattails. They fooled me. All right, so it doesn't look like there's any cattails here. That's fine. All right, so what else do we need? The sewing kits I think I can make. I'm pretty sure I have the bleak skins also, the waltz bleak skins. And then the old regs I'm pretty sure I have as well. So let's just uh, grab whatever we can on the way back. I see something glittering here, so let's go ahead and snag that. Whatever we can on the way back, sure. Moss, yep, grab that too. My stamina is running dangerously low. Uh, and then we'll head back to the house and see what we can make with what we got. All right, home sweet home. And good thing, too, because my inventory's a little full of stuff. Let's go up here, and uh, actually, the the honey I'm just going to leave in here, just because it's not really... it's it, You can only eat it raw. Um, like, if you look at it raw, you can't actually cook this stuff. So I'm just going to leave it there for just food. Now, nah, you know what? I'm indecisive. I'm indecisive. I'm going to take it with me. I'm going to go up here and stash it away into the center one here. Uh, all right, so we're gonna need one two three of those things for sure and then let's store that and that those 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 Actually, I think I'm gonna need those in a little bit Stashing all my stuff here so that I can get a little inventory management done I went ahead and grabbed a couple of them as well and the moss do I have that in here? I do okay. I don't really have that too much that I should probably grab a couple more bits of that um, All right, so I need two sewing threads, which I think were fish bones and jute ropes was it I think it is I think, I'm thinking that's it. Let's go down and make sure. Let's see if I'm losing my mind or if that's what it was. I was going off memory there, and if that's correct, I'm going to give myself a high five. All right, sewing threads. It is. High five. Sweet. All right, let's go ahead and craft two of these things. I knew those fish bones would come in handy somewhere along the way, the way here. All right, and then so uh, then we just need three old rags. There we go. Got it. Nice. 
All right, let's go ahead and craft this. Let's see. So this won't increase my speed a whole lot, but it will give me a whole lot more stamina so I don't have to stop and rest as much. Plus, it'll give me a little cold resist. This is the one I wanted to make because then I could just take off like Sonic. I should call this the Sonic outfit. But it's the cattails, which I haven't found yet, and it's the beeswax plus the moss stump. I'm basically short on everything. So let's go ahead and just craft this one instead. All right, so now, it, do I have it equipped? Is that the thing? Uh, this is the... Uh, Norbert Lumber Outfit, which is what you're, I'm currently wearing. And this is the Grosbeak Wander Outfit, which I want to currently wear now. Oh, look at that. I got little stamina meters underneath my stamina meter. Oh, it doesn't fill up all the way. Okay, so I take it if I fill, make the other one, it will. Oh, yes, I can run a lot longer now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Awesome. It looks like there's other outfits, too, that you can unlock. Cool. I didn't show you this, but check this out. We got flora that I can find. There's the cattails I'm still missing, obviously. Basically, I got to pick up this stuff to actually learn what it is. And unfortunately, it doesn't like tell you where you found it, so like you could find it again. There's also a lot of exploration I need to do still. There's still a few locations I haven't found, as well as a couple of rooms I still need to add. Okay, so now that we have a little bit extra speed and a better outfit, why don't we try for a backpack? I think that'd be a good idea. Let's look at backpacks here. Which one can I reasonably make? I don't really want to use the dog's mane. This is the one I want to make right here. But I need chicory. Huh. I have the hoof fungus. I can make the sewing threads. I can make. I can get sticks. It's the chicory is the only thing I'm missing. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little break here. I'm going to eat my food because I'm getting a little hungry. Make some more food. Maybe, uh, let's eat this. It's also storming outside right now. Hear the rumble of thunder. Uh, so I'm going to stay inside for right now, stay warm, cook up a little bit more food here, and then I'm going to look on the internet, which I clearly don't have out here, <laughs> and I'm going to see where chicory might be, just so that I can add, uh, go get this. I need two more pieces. I just need two more. So close. All right, that was very, very unhelpful. <laughs> All right, some people are saying the south side of the map. Another person said the northern part where you find the the, uh, the lime deposits. Um, basically, every, now I did find one up here. So possibly find more. Some people are saying they spawn only during certain times of the day. I'll tell you what, let's go on an adventure. Let's do an adventure instead. Let's head south and head towards these other lime deposits. Let's go, we'll even grab the pickaxe in case we can grab more. I, now, I don't know if I'm going to need more, but I do know that you need to make glue. Uh, so let's just throw that in there right now because uh, I don't know why I have it. So we're going to head uh, south. Now, I haven't made the compass, but uh, I believe south is behind the, the house here. You can always tell if you're heading the right direction by just running a little bit, pulling up the map again. Yeah, all right, I'm heading the right way. We're going to head south here and see if we can't find anything. I'm looking for chicory. That would be ideal if I could find that. But if not, I'm going to try to grab as many supplies as possible. Maybe try to find another location where I can gather this uh, these lime uh, chunks. And then, uh, and then we'll go from there. Let's see what we can find. Found a new location, White Flower Meadow. I wonder where they got the name. All right, so new locations are fun. What kind of good resources do they have here? Chicory, perhaps. Uh, if we look in the map, I am just, I just head south, so I do gotta head a little bit more east too. But there's this big cliff in the way, so that could be a problem. I'm trying not to grab too many supplies unless it's something I absolutely need. Now, I, I did grab some uh, stump moss because I know I'm running a little low on that, so I'll grab that as I go. I'll also grab any beehives I find, too. And, of course, any chicory that I find. Oh. Okay, so I found some debris. This is going to cause a little bit of a problem because I do want to grab this stuff because I don't really have a way to renewably grab any more of it. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to want to grab this stuff. What's my, my inventory is going to be a disaster before I even get too far into this adventure. I wish those seeds stacked. Boy, that would really make my life a lot easier. My inventory is already completely full. So I might have... Sun, sun is also setting, so maybe I'll actually head back home once I get all this stuff. And then... Uh, and then maybe head back here right away in the morning. Kind of sounds like a plan. Let's look in here real quick. I do have my lockpicks with me. <clears throat> this is why I need a backpack. This is why I need a backpack, actually. So that I don't have to turn around. I can just store the stuff in the backpack and keep on going. 
All right, swing and a miss on this adventure, although I did find a lot of other really helpful supplies, so I'm not going to be too upset. Plus, I found this new area, this new biome here. It's white flowers area, so I guess it wasn't too big of a swing and a miss. I'm going to take a little bit of a wide berth here and see if I can't see anything special along the way back home. Like some trickery would be nice. Um, black current right there on the ground. I'm trying to find anything that's a little bit more useful than the stuff I caught. Or the stuff I just got there. Now my, my stamina still runs out, but it takes a little bit longer to happen. So walking, even downhill, will also drain your stamina. So that's kind of a thing you got to keep an eye on. And then when your stamina is low and in the red like that, that means it burns through your hunger really fast. So you don't really want to have that happen. Head on a swivel here, looking desperately for more chicory. Oh. Oh, that's chicory right there. Something's getting tossed. Um, uh, the turnip seeds were going to discard you. Sorry, I should have never grabbed you. Grabbing that chicory. I did actually find one. Sweet. Where am I? Where, let's make a mental note. Right down here. So they, I thought there was one here, but it looks like maybe it was over here. Now, some people online were saying that it only happens at night, and it, it happens to be night. So, did they have a point? Maybe. If that's the case, I'm going to look around a little bit more. I wonder if things only do spawn at night. I never really thought about that before, but I'm also quite a ways away from any kind of water source, and it's getting dark and cold, so I'm going to head home, sleep. In the morning, i got to go get water right away. This is why you make a canteen. Ooh, I'm actually probably a little far away from home. So we did find some chicory. Sweet. Oh, awesome. All right, so I need one more. Now, my new outfit will actually protect me against the cold a little bit better. Hmm. I found one right when it turned night. I wonder if they do have a point online when they said that chicory only spawns at night. In which case, I probably don't want to sleep. Dehydrated. That's probably not good. That's probably a problem. Alright, first off, let's go get warmed up. Then I might make a night run to go get some, uh, some water, actually. Let's go get warmed up in here. Stash my inventory, too, for sure. Go get some water at night so that maybe... Uh, I know this one right over here. So that maybe uh, I can find some chicory at night if, if what they're saying online is true. I don't even know if it's the case. But it looks like that is number three. I just need one more, and I can actually make this really good backpack. All right, let's go get some water. I know it's cold out here, but I got that extra layer of protection on now, so I should be... Ooh, it's dropping already. It's dropping already. See, this is also why I should look into making the tent. I should have made the, made the tent before doing any of, the, any of this. The tent and the campfire, I could have just set up camp while I was out and about. Then again, I do need inventory space, so I know maybe the campfire isn't the way to go yet. Let's get some water while I'm here. I didn't see any chicory, but I did see this piece of driftwood right here, which I'm going to grab. I don't know if I'm going to need any more of that, but I'm going to grab it just to, anyway because I'm, I'm heading back. Anyway, is there moss on this thing right here? No, i got to keep an eye on my temperature, though. No moss on that thing. What's this? Sure, I'll grab it just because it's free and I'm, uh, I'm here, so... All right, let's head back because my temperature's dropping a little too quickly for my comfort. Don't really feel like freezing to death out here. All right, well, we found one chicory. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all, but not for the first day. Tomorrow, we're heading out to try to see if we can't find another one. All right, I'm freezing. I'm sleepy. Boy, I'm not in good shape right now. This is what you get for running around at night. Terrible, terrible times. All right, let's get inside and uh, let's store this stuff real fast. And then we're going to take a little power nap here and pass it on into the next day. So we're going to be on day 8. Wow, we're still alive. Alright, good night everybody. Good night. Alright, starting the second week off here in the woods. Getting a little hungry, let's go ahead and just eat right away and get our next meal made right away so that I have that always available. Um, really sucks I had to throw out those turnip seeds last episode, didn't really want to, but had to because uh, chicory is a little bit more important. So let's go ahead and stash those things in there, cook that up. Cook, cook, okay, there, it's going to run out of kindling though, so we're going to need some more sticks. Add the sticks to that, cook up. There we go. All right, let's get some food. Take this on uh, with us on the road. I should really look into that water canteen. That that almost got me in a lot of trouble last time. Am I going to learn from it? No. We're going right back there. <laughs> 
All right, so one thing I wanted to find was it says that there's actually uh, places to mine here. Now, it also looks like there's a cliff edge right here, which is impassable. Maybe there's a pass right there. I'm not too sure. But instead of running all the way down there, I'm going to run over to this place right here and see if I can't get through there instead. And if not, then i got to try to get past the bear. Which, that could be a problem. Let's go this way. Because the bear is blocking my way to that area of the world. And if that area of the world has chicory, then I want to get it. I'm going to snag that as I go here. I can always munch on those things. So I'm trying to think, have I ever seen chicory when it hasn't been evening? And honestly, I can't really tell. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I honestly can't really tell. I can't remember if I have or not. But it makes me wonder if those people are telling the truth online. Because there's really no... There's really no wiki for this. <laughs> this this game is a is kind of like a find it out on your own type thing. Let's see if I'm going the right way. Yeah, I am. Okay. So I could absolutely be screwing screwing things up here. Um, those are your, the leaves, the yellow leaves, which I don't really need quite yet. Keep checking the map to see where I'm going here. This looks like this leads to a dead end. Is there a chicory at the end of this? It looks like just those yellow leaves back there. Don't need those right now. I'll probably be kicking myself later for not grabbing them. But inventory space is limited, so I'm going to try to keep it limited to just what I can carry. There's a beehive. Okay, beehives. I've learned that I'm going to want to grab these whenever I see them. Because I want to get that outfit that makes me super speedy, the Sonic the Hedgehog outfit. And for that, I'm going to need beehives. Get out of here. Run. Run. Do a loop. Do a loop. Going back to grab the honey honeycomb. Screw you, bees. All right, we'll grab the honey, too, while we're at it. I can always eat that while I'm out here as well. All right, so I definitely want to grab the beehives whenever I can. Oh, there's the bear. Okay, so is the bear the place? Is the bear the thing that, uh, uh, is the bear the thing that I need to deal with? I'm going to need to deal with the bear on our, dang it. Oops, pause it out there on accident. That is definitely something I'm going to have to deal with or get get around to get to this part of the map. Or I can go up and over. I wonder if I can just go up and over. You know what? Let's try to sneak past the bear. This could be a problem. This could be a big mistake. Stuck on something. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that, that's right. Got past the bear. Old rags will grab because I think I'm going to need them for trying to get back because I'm going to definitely get mauled by that bear. That was insane. That bear was right next to me. I could have just patted it on the butt. What is this? Is this another cave? Is this where I can... I do have my pickaxe, right? Okay, yes, I do. This is new. Huh. Is this the bear's den? Am I going into the bear's den? It's Starglow Cave. Nifty. Very, very pleasant name. Doesn't sound like I'm going to get mauled by anything in here. Let's get a drink of water while I'm here, too. Good to top that off whenever you can. Yes, there is actually more stuff here. There is, um, there's more lime here. Go ahead and grab this. Since this stuff, uh, it seems to be a pretty rare material. And I think I need it, what, for glue? So I'm going to want to grab, grab this whenever I can. Okay, there appears to be 10 in this cave also, so that's kind of nice. Am I topped off on water? Is everything good? Let's just drink a little bit more water while we're here. All right, good to know. So does this mark it on the map? It does, but I do have to get to the bear to get to it. I don't know if I really need to do that any anymore, because I have all the lime I could possibly want. Um, so unless there's something else down the line that I need a whole bunch for, I'm not going to worry about it too much. So now chicory seems to be the only thing that I'm missing. Hmm, make a mental note. I did find that one when it turned nighttime, so it's entirely possible that chicory only spawns in at night. Which might be why it's so rare. Alright, so we're just adventuring at this point. We're just exploring. What's this? Worm, wormwood rot root? I'm gonna grab that just because I haven't ever seen that before. And who knows, it could be like a super rare thing. There's another mushroom. Oh, I'm finding new stuff. 
All right, I'm finding new stuff. Um, let's go ahead and eat and eat that. And we're gonna pick this up too. Okay, I'm finding new things over here. Nifty. Okay, good to know. I mean, when you explore new areas, you tend to find new things. But I wouldn't mind finding like another beehive. Oh, I think I just, I think I just spotted one. Yep. All right, let's get another beehive while we're out here. So I want, I want, yeah, I want that other thing. I want, I think that it's uh, the better backpack. Bishop's lace. I don't know what that is either. Oh, that's something else too. We're just running in circles. Let's grab bishop's lace and see what that is. I don't have a lot of room. It's a brewing ingredient. I'm not sure if I super need it or not. I think I've caught those or got those, that one before, the moral mushrooms before. But I'm not too sure. Let's grab that. Grab that. Sweet. We're gonna want that. All right, we're doing another loop here, just looking for chicory. It's really the only thing we need. We need one chicory at this point. I will drop my pickaxe if I have to, just to get that. It's still midday, but it's got to be getting. Sun's got to be starting to set here pretty soon. What is this thing? Fiddlehead fern. Sure, we'll grab that because uh, in the meantime, I'll just I'll just grab it just because I haven't found chicory yet. I'll figure out what to sacrifice if I do find it. I'm going to keep venturing around until it starts saying that the sun is setting, and then I'm going to turn around. Because it says that our house is that way, but I can't actually... Ooh, I can't actually get to it that way. You know what? I might want to start heading back now, because I'm actually really far out here, and if the sun starts setting, I'm not going to be able to get back in time without freezing to death. So yeah, alright, I'm going to start... I'm going to turn around, I'm going to start heading back. Maybe I'll find it on the way back, because the, the sun will probably start setting as I'm going here. And then, uh, let's see, I also have food that I can eat. That, that's something I can use to make room in my inventory as well. Uh, so, solid doggo? I don't know what that is. Let's go ahead and uh, eat my food. That way I'll have an open spot. I'll grab it. At least I'll have it, and then uh, I'll be confused about it later. That one I already have in my inventory, so we can go ahead and grab more of that. All right, where am I right now? Let's start heading due west completely. I was basically head right back towards the house. Yeah, just a little bit north of the house here. Or Bishop's Lace. I don't know if that's going to come in handy later or not. I have no idea because I, I did not get to brewing when I uh, when I was testing this world. So that's all new stuff to me. What is that Sadalgo thing used for? Another thing used for brewing. Maybe I can make some beer. Now, I think I'm going north of the bear. Yeah, I am. So I don't think I'm going to be running into the bear out here. Or at least not that one. I do want to start heading home for sure because it is starting to get a little darker out here now. And if there was ever going to be a chicory, I think that it would be showing up here right about now. I also have only found this one lake. I wouldn't mind finding another one that I could do some fishing in. Oh, look at this. This is a different color of plains. What's up with that? Maybe just a dry area? A lot of sand there, perhaps? Oh, no, there's more planes here. This isn't a new biome? Nothing popped up. That's crazy. Oh, is that a beehive? Going for the beehive. How much How much do these stack? Up to 10? Oh, absolutely, I'm going for the beehive. I should be collecting these things the whole time. All right, they're not going to be like... They're not going to like that. There's bishop lace in this in this field, though, a lot of it. All right, let's go ahead and grab that and that. And let's go back here and grab the bishop's lace since I'm holding it already. There's a whole bunch of it here, which is crazy. I wonder if this is, like, this, the big stockpile. How much of this can I hold? Ten? Oh, yeah. I can hold quite a bit of it. All right, sun is setting, so now I absolutely do need to get back. Another beehive. Sure. Sure, I got time. Yeah, no problem. Good stuff. All right, now the sun is starting to get low, which means that if chicory does spawn in in the world at night, I should be in prime condition to actually find it. <clears throat> Unless it only spawns in at night, in which case then I'm not going to find it on this run. Of course, I don't know where it spawns in either. That's is that the lake I know? That's the lake I already know of. 
Moral mushroom. Oh, the other one was a zebra moral mushroom. Dang it, I bet you that was something different. I should probably grab that. Where was that? That was somewhere over here. <laughs> I really should have grabbed that. Now, I am kind of taking the long way around here. I'm actually kind of circling around here because, again, looking for chicory, and if it does only spawn at night... Gooseberry. I don't know. I don't have any room for that. I don't think I've ever... Well, no, I haven't seen too many gooseberries around here, so that's something kind of new. I wonder... I wonder if there's some validity to it. Does things only spawn at night? That'd be quite interesting if that be the case. I don't know the ins and outs of this game, so it's entirely possible that that's true. Alright, I'm going to start heading back home, though, because it is nighttime now, so it's going to start getting colder. And I also... Let's just take a quick peek up here real fast. I also need to dump my inventory, obviously, because it's completely full. I don't see any up here. Dang it. Alright, let's get back before I freeze to death. Gonna have to admit defeat. Okay, so I only found one chicory this episode. Not bad, considering I've only ever found two prior to this, so that's not, like, a terrible thing. But, I was really hoping they'd be able to get the other ones so that I could finish that backpack. But you can't win them all. And plus, I'm also getting really tired. It looks like there, my Z's are getting really low. So I'm gonna definitely need to head back now. Wave the white flag. Try again on another day. Chicory, where are you? Okay, I made it back safe and sound. I'm tempted to go grab some water before I sleep, actually. Give me a chance to go spot some ch chicory. <laughs> Still desperately trying to find that. Let's go ahead and stash uh, all of this, actually, in here. I'm going to stash this stuff in here. And then stash this one in here. I can probably put the pickaxe away, too, because I don't know of any other caves, and I don't have any more hints on my map as to where those are, so I'm going to stash those things. But let's go get some water real fast, and, and like I said, it'll, it'll give me a chance to see if maybe I can spot some sprouting chicory. Alright, got to the water. Didn't see any chicory on the way here. Nope, I, don't th I think that's a bust. I think it's a bust. I gotta get back before I pass out in the middle of the woods and get eaten by a bear. Alright, back at the cabin. Nice and sleepy. I think I'm going to wrap this episode up here, though, because I am very tired. I'm going to get some food going for tomorrow. So if you did enjoy this, please go down and smash that like button. It would have really helped me out a lot. Thank you guys so much for donating your eyeballs and your holes to this episode. I will be back with more Among Trees. Cook, please. Um, in, uh, in the next episode. So thanks again for watching, everybody. And bye-bye. <laughs>